No, we're not there yet, but we have reached the point where we've directly detected space-time. And that takes us one step closer to learning how to play with it in order to figure out how to harness and control the energy required for technologies like warp drive. For now, I'll take that one step closer. The light sail is another technology that is gradually moving from the realm of science fiction into the realm of science fact. We briefly discussed light sails back in lecture five, but it is a technology that Carl Sagan first proposed and then the Planetary Society actually developed. This is a very promising technology for traveling into deep space that was explored in the Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode, Explorers, where Commander Sisko revives an ancient Bajoran light sail to test out. In the episode, they recreate a legendary journey and encounter a tachyon eddy which flings them all the way to a different planet. While we have yet to discover anything resembling a tachyon eddy, the idea of using light and radiation particles from the sun to travel into deep space was partially realized in real life in July 2019. That's when the Light Sail 2 was launched into Earth's orbit by the Planetary Society, deployed its sails, and was able to change its orbit just by using radiation from the sun. This was declared a mission success, making science fiction a reality and taking another step towards humans exploring deep space. 